In the swirling storm of modern political debate, concerns about the fragile integrity of freedom, control, and democracy itself take center stage. Hakeem Jeffries' words strike a chord with a public wary of the growing concentration of power within the government, fearing an ominous overreach that could tip the scales too far, suffocating individual liberty. His remarks echo through a landscape where political rhetoric not only sparks immediate unease, but also stokes the deeper, simmering fears about the future of democracy. Donald Trump and his allies are already starting to lay the groundwork uh, to contest the election results in November. Are you confident that a Republican-led House will certify the 2024 election in January? I'm confident that we're going to do everything that we need to do over the next few months to make sure that House Democrats take back the majority so that the American people do not have to encounter that question. It is a reality that far too many of my extreme MAGA Republican colleagues in the House have engaged in election denial conspiracy theories and have tried to undermine the very fabric of our democracy and the peaceful transfer of power. By the way, Jake, that's what Trump's Project 2025 is all about. The extreme mega Republicans want total control over the lives of the American people, total control over our government and total control over our democracy. And we've got to stop it from happening. Hakeem Jeffries finds himself entangled in a projection, a maneuver where he criticizes his political rivals with the very strategy his own party is perceived to employ. His critique raises alarms among those who fear an escalating spiral of government overreach, control, and the slow erosion of individual freedoms. To many, Jeffrey's comments seem emblematic of a common political dance, where one side deflects scrutiny by accusing the other of harboring the same controversial ambitions, underscoring the fierce, underlying battle for the nation's soul.